Hey guys, so today we're going to be teaching you how to replace the screen of HP Note 15 AN050CA. First you want to unscrew the screen here. Usually it's located hidden behind some black buttons. Right now as you can see we have the red missing from the screen so it's just blue and green. And so we need to replace the screen. Take out the screws. These screws aren't really seen at first, so you have to take out some uh, black dots right at the bottom where it's where you see the screws are located now. They're usually glued on there a little bit. Pop those off. I'm going to turn off the computer so you don't get shocked. You want to take off the plastic rim, start from the top and work your way around. Be a bit careful so you don't break the screen at this point. Now, I'm going to unscrew some things over here. Bolt to the computer, they're small. But be careful not to lose these ones. They're located right at the top corners of your screen. Same thing for the, just all the corners in general. You see these little metal hinges here? And last corner. Alright, so now you're going to take the screen, slightly peel it off. Take that part off. You're going to find that there's a wire attached to it here. Now what you want to do is unclip that wire. There you go, it comes off, slides off. Now you get your new screen. It's packaged here. Just ensure you get the right resolution for it and it's the right size before you buy it. And clip it on just like you took it off, clips on slides right on there. Position it. Make sure you angle the metal hinges so it aligns with the ones at the back of the panel. Like so. Just like you took them off, just screw it back in. There's two screws at the top and one screw at the bottom for each corner. 
Just turn it on to see if it works before you put on the panel. HP logo turns on. And take off that panel. If it works, just take it off. There we go. Very satisfying. <laughs> Put the screen back slightly so it's easier to put it in just into the hinges here. So you put them down and then you squeeze forward. And you want to screw in the bottom. First off. You're going to hear it pop into place a little bit. and work your way back from the bottom up. First you want to finish off both sides. So once you get to the middle, just keep on going. You should hear a click about every inch and a half or so. And don't forget the bottom, of course. Just see if the screen works. Still turn it on. And there we go. We got some red here. That's it. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good day.